Hi friends! As the weather warms up and we start talking about water, we wanted to remind you of one of our favorite projects that we would be doing at school at this time, which is spray paint art. All you need for this project is spray bottles of water, liquid watercolors, some paper, and I have butcher paper, but you can use computer paper instead if that's what you have, and tape. Let's get started in setting up this project. I added liquid watercolors to my spray bottles, and you can add as much as you like. It depends on how intense the color you want. I have a couple different shades of green and a purple. We'll see what that pattern looks like once I get started. Behind me, you can see that I have taped up this butcher paper onto the fence here so that I can spray it outside. Let's go ahead and get started with this art. Next, you'll need to wait for the paper to dry. If you try to move it while it's still wet, the paper will probably rip. So wait for it to dry, and then you can take it down. Once your paper is dry, you can use it for whatever kind of art project you want. Sometimes I like to tear it up and use it for collages, and other times I just like to cut it up into smaller pieces and use the individual pieces of paper for writing on or drawing on. I think that's what I'm gonna do with this set. I hope you have fun making spray paint art.